So what's actually happened is that um, it's actually got stuck in this very stagnant um, column of fluid called a, a stratified Taylor column. The iceberg since then has just been slowly rotating about once every 24 days or so. Um, so it's doing a full uh, kind of 360 degrees during that period. And for something that's so big, that's that's quite impressive. You know, the iceberg probably weighs, you know, up to, a, you know, almost a trillion tons. Um, then uh, getting something of that scale to move requires an awful lot of energy. So we haven't really seen icebergs interacting with these before. Um, I'm sure they have. Um, but of course, we've only got uh, kind of 35 years ish. Uh, of satellite data to go on. So these really large megabergs, uh, such as uh, A23A, um, obviously do pose a hazard to uh, to shipping. Um, we're quite lucky these days that we have such good satellite imagery of uh, of these bergs and the cruise vessels and um, and container ships and and research vessels in these waters will be using those kind of images to plot effective navigation routes. Um, so it's certainly something that they'll need to keep an eye out for while they're they're transiting Drake Passage going forward, you know, particularly for making that that transit between, for example, uh, the Falklands and, and South Georgia. Uh, I think that it may well end up where the the iceberg, if it escapes this Taylor column, uh, which it eventually will, uh, will transit up towards South Georgia. So, you know, we are quite lucky these days in 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 the products that we have to to track these to track these big bergs. But I think it's likely that particularly in the West Antarctic, we will get more of these um, as we look 20, 30, 40 years into the future. Um, and so, you know, understanding how they interact with both the ocean circulation, uh, the tracks that they tend to take, uh, and any impacts that has on, for example, shipping, uh, I think we'll, we'll need to bear in mind uh, more as we, as we move into a, a, a world that's, uh, that's getting warmer.